everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Lebo if you're new here very warm welcome to you and if you're a regular viewer of my hair videos welcome back I know it's been so long but yeah I'm back with a hair video and this one is sponsored by Alfin Hair they sent me these bundles for this ponytail I wanted a really like um dainty sleek sleek back ponytail kind of look and I think I'm in my ponytail era. So they were kind enough to send me these bundles. Shout out to them. I did get three bundles from Alfin Hair, but I just decided to use two of the bundles for the ponytail because I just wanted a um, sort of like a sleek kind of ponytail and I didn't want it to be too bulgy. So I only used two of the bundles, but they did send me three bundles. And um, the package does come as like three bundles. So thank you very much to Off and Hair for sponsoring this video. Uh, if you're interested in seeing how I got this ponytail done, then keep watching the video. <laughs> keep watching the video and yeah, let me know what you think in the comment section. I hope you enjoy the video. Let's get right into it. Also, I'm going out tonight, so I really need to look good. Like this hair, really needs to look out. I'm doing a slight middle part. This is. I'm just sectioning out um, the hair that I'm going to sleek back last because it's going to be part of my middle part of the making things. So I'm gonna use um, some got to be. I had to cut mine in half because I literally ran out. So I'm just gonna jar the hair back and put it in a ponytail.
I'm just gonna jaw the hair down some more. And yeah, we gonna see. So I just swooped the baby hairs. I literally just did like normal baby hairs. You can do like what you're comfortable with. I'm gonna wrap the hair completely. Gonna make it quite tight. <gasps> no, no, no. I moved the thing. I knew it, I moved it. And I'm gonna wrap this for about 10 minutes. I'm in quite a rush, so I typically wrap it for longer, but I am in a rush. So I'm just gonna do like 10 minutes. So this is how it looks. I'm just gonna sew this part on here and then it's gonna look like this. Also, I'm gonna spray some holding spray onto it so that it can just become a little bit more firm. Not too much, because I don't want my hair to get too dirty. I know that's quite inevitable, but yeah. So this is the point where I'm gonna start wrapping the first bundle. And I'm gonna use, I'm gonna be using ribbons to secure the bundles. You can sew it in if you want, but I prefer to use ribbons so I can take it off when I go sleep. I just don't like to sleep with, um, a ponytail because it's like it's just too much tension on my hair and yeah but if you want it to last like a few more days and obviously yeah you can sew it in you can sew it on so i'm going to take this part and it's going to be my starting point i am going to Take this ribbon and wrap it around. going to be the part that I am wrapping the first bundle around. see I don't have the middle parting anymore it's just like a sleek back sleek back whatever um so the ponytail it didn't work out the first time the first attempt and I was actually going to an event that day so I was running late and I ended up just getting it done at the salon but yeah I'm back now to show you guys how I do the ponytail because I can do it I just didn't have enough time that day but yeah, I'm using the same technique that I showed you in the first few clips. You um, plait your natural hair, your own hair into like a ponytail and you basically just like wrap the bundles around the little ponytail like I'm doing. Now, also you have to keep like brushing throughout so that it, it doesn't get, so that the bundles don't get like tangled up. It's just, it's a process, it's a process. Also, my mirror is there, so that's why I'm going to be looking at it the whole time. And yeah, hopefully, you can see here what I'm doing at the back. So, 
so I'm almost done wrapping up I'm wrapping around the first bundle so I'm gonna take this first part and I'm going to use my, um, my ribbon and secure the end. This is the part where you might actually want to sew it in because um, I don't plan on having like the ponytail for long. I'm just gonna use a ribbon so that I can take it off easily. And then once you have um, secured the pony, like the end of the first bundle, this is the other part. You are going to take your second bundle. This is the second bundle. And you're gonna take the second bundle, just a little bit, this part, the small little part. And um, join it into the first bundle I hope this makes sense I'm just going to take a brush to make it neater And you're going to continue wrapping that bundle into the second bundle on to the ponytail to the first bundle. Oh, my hands are tired. I'm literally in hell. Like it's not fun. It's not fun for me. Yo, let's continue. a significant amount of the of the end of the of the second bundle and then I am going to start wrapping wrapping it around and also while I do that I like to use my um, like a firm hold spray you can also just use like a got to be spray there's something that's going to sort of like keep it together because the hair is very slippery And then I'm going to take uh, I use a bobby pen to just secure it small little end put it in there and then you just continue the journey And there you have the ponytail. 
I am noticing right now that it's I think it's a bit slanted a bit more to the left I don't know why but it's not a chain smash for me 